Welcome back to another part of Dying Light 2. Stay human. If you do enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and let's get it. Once, I was taking my second wife to the hospital. Never drove that fast in my life. Her waters broke three months early. You have kids? There was no saving that one. And other than that, none that I know of. Sorry. It's fine. What normal person would want his kids to see a world like this? So we're, we don't want them to scream and stuff, right? I think. It's a howler at the bottom here. We have to get there. I think it's better if we avoid the floor at the moment. There's so many enemies, dude. I also checked up a guide on uh, how to set perfect graphics. Hurry up, Aiden. We have to get in and out of the hospital while it's night time. There will be a lot of infected here in the morning. There's a lot of infected right here, right now, also. Broken. Don't worry. Find the old bus. A bus? At zero hour, a bus crashed into the hospital. Broke through the wall. You can use it to get inside. Since no one could get in, there's a good chance there'll be some markers left. Okay, so let's find the bus. There's a screamer here also. We're level 2. We're so screwed, man. Come on, got it. Kill them here. So much blood everywhere. <laughs> All my doing. And the reason why they take so much to, to, to kill is because they're level two. So I'm hoping of this. Better loot. Hoping. Yeah, this feels so much better, dude. Can't we go? Yeah, we can't squeeze through there, it seems. Open this door. I'm at the main entrance. 
I marked a safe route for you. I'm waiting by the lobby. Don't see any loot anywhere. Finding loot in this game is pretty tough. Hey, this way. Big building, huh? Yeah, pretty huge. Took over quite a few of these for drug research. When it all got fucked, they grabbed research volunteers. And they paid them loads of money. What was the result? A lot of shit. Just a little more. We don't have much time. Stay close to me. I'll do my best. Do you trust lights in real life to walk on them like this? I don't know. They're literally a brink from collapsing, right? <clears throat> Door's locked. You know how to open locks? Sure. Turn the key. What if you don't have a key? Hakon, I've traveled thousands of kilometers. You think doors are a problem for me? <laughs> okay, just checking. I think this room should have all the instruments you need, Maestro. I want some scrap. You can make lock picks out of that. Okay, so this will be the first time we... Oh man, look at all this loot below us. No. This will be the first time we're gonna use or and craft a lockpick. Set quantity. Ah, good work. Okay, uh, use lockpicks to open doors and containers. Okay, use a scrap to craft them uh, to pick a lock. Correct position with the upper pick. I move the lower pick with the mouse. Okay. Let's try this. Why are you not going up when I tell you? Huh? You didn't lie. You know your stuff. I had no other choice. Was forced to know my stuff. I assume they're talking about his training. Oh, what the hell? Being a pilgrim or something. Yeah. from the inside. But the more I think about it, this, this game feels like The Last of Us, but like parkour style, baby. Whoa, what, what? Did something damage me? What damaged me? <sighs> Fuck. A place to hide. Bro, you really suck with doors, isn't it? Call oh, some help. There you go.
Mia? Eddie, where are you? That's a bad idea, Mia. If it was a good one, it wouldn't be fun. What are you doing? Mia, not on the wall. Stop talking and give me your hand. Aiden, everything okay? Yeah. Are you sure? Talk to me. This hospital, I've been in one like this before. A GRE facility, where there are a few of them around the city. I'm having these, these memories. The person I'm looking for is Mia, she's my sister. There was a guy here named Waltz. I don't know. It's all mixed up in my head. Oh, you suppressed the memory. Like I did of my third wife. Look, I'm sure the infection ain't helping. Chin up. We'll find the marker and clear out. Let's go. Your third wife. Good news, dude. Okay, now we're at the bottom, where we saw all the loot. But we also see a ton of enemies beyond this door. level one though so we could actually take them on if we wanted to I wonder if you'll wake them up with your flashlight it doesn't seem like it though I know in The Last of Us also, if you... If you put on your flashlight versus not putting it on, uh, the zombies doesn't see the flashlight, so... Making it a little bit easier. <coughs> What's that? Chemicals. Nasty shit. When they lost control of the virus, the GRE started spraying the whole city with that filth. Worked out great for them, huh? <clears throat> mm hmm This place actually used to look nice, I'm pretty sure. Oopsie.
remain crouched, my son. My good nurse. So, this guy you told me about, what was his name? Waltz? Yes. Why did you mention him? Because I remember he was doing some kind of experiment. <sighs> he wasn't the only one doing them. There were more cities like Villador, with walls cut off from the rest of the world. Many people were working toward a vaccine they did. But, well, the world is full of shitheads. That is so true. I'm sure everything we're looting is going to be useful at some point. It's just best for us to keep looting. Stepping off it before I jump. Give me a sec. Hurry. We're running out of time. Can we climb up? Oh. I mean, if we could wait our stamina out, we'll be fine. We can't. You see. I can't make it. Wait. I've got an idea. Remember the cocktail I served you earlier? At the girls' workshop. Inhibitors. Exactly. You fell to the first floor. There's some GRE storage down there. Look for white, green crates. Inhibitors should be inside. If you take another dose, you should get your strength back. Okay, GRE access key. Inhibitor, yeah. Inhibitor. Okay. Well, let's see what we could do. How do you let go? So I'm pretty sure if you play New Game Plus, you would be able to climb up there. We got company. A volatile. Don't move. You can't handle that. I know. I've seen this fucker. It seems like a volatile, you need to just stand still. And you'll be fine. So at the bottom it shows six meter, uh, 9 meters, 10.
17, 15. So here it is, but on the other side of this door. So we need to crouch all the way through these sleeping beauties, is what they call them. Nice and slow. Hurry. If that infected finds you, you're dead. Chicken, 80. Yeah, 80 potato. We got this, I think. <laughs> Inhibitor container nearby. Did, did my key just talk to me? Or... Here also. I just want most loot that I could get that is on my path. If I can craft stuff, I will, you know. Okay, inhibitors, stamina and health increase, okay. Unlocks of skills. Uh, each upgrade requires three inhibitors. Okay. In inhibitors can be found in GRE crates, hidden in the GRE quarantines and GRE uh, anomaly locations. Okay. So now we can level up this, allows you to climb higher and fight longer without losing stamina level. That's pretty, pretty nice, actually. And all of this will increase your immunity. I'm, I'm assuming you'll become more immune to the virus. What's up? I took the inhibitor. Go back to the elevator. I'm waiting. So I assume this will help you um, do things easier. Uh, but the way this upgrade worked makes me think of Days Gone. Let's see, maybe now we could, uh... Hello? Hack on. Oh. 
Okay. We made it. Hurry, I found the markers. You were gone a while. How are you feeling? I'm infected, but good to go. Yeah, that's great. Sorry about this. What? I'm sorry about what? <laughs> about that. On behalf of all its whores, bandits, and idiots, I christen you a citizen of Villador. Fuck. <laughs> You're about to turn. Get into the light fast. I was about to drink. Hello, baby. How you doing? Close. <sighs> oh, what would you do without me, Pilgrim? <laughs> I never wanted to become a pilgrim. I just sort of fell into it. I roamed the country for another reason entirely. I'm looking for my sister. And then what? And then? What will you do once you find your sister? I don't know, dude. To be honest. I haven't thought about that. Well, that's odd. Well, there'll be time for that, once I find her. Once you find her? Well, I have a very specific plan. You look like someone with a specific plan. I'd like to live by the ocean. You know, it's supposed to be easier there. I always wanted to learn how to surf. What, you find a bunch of old postcards or something? Ah, don't <laughs> laugh at my dreams, man. I know one thing. I have to get out of this city. It's killing me. Right from the inside. Will you help me? The ocean's a long way from here. And we're both infected. People don't want pilgrims for their neighbors. Pfft, fuck people. I will help you with them. And you can help me survive on the road. You know the routes. You know how to survive out in the open. What do you think? We cover each other's asses. How does that sound? I love the idea, actually. Okay. Let's do it. Awesome. Deal. You won't regret this, Aiden. I promise. As for your goal, here's the situation around here. After the PK commander was murdered, they blocked the route to the center. They're trying to keep the killer from escaping. To get to Fisheye, we have to outsmart them. But I know when they change the night guard. That will be our chance. I'm gonna get the stuff we'll need for the passage. I have to suss out our odds. Meantime, take a look around. Live a little. Uh, come on. Let me show you something. That two women he was with, isn't that like his friends is just gonna leave them behind to go surfing? That, that sounds illogical, actually. And please bring one of your girlfriends with, you know? You don't want to go surfing all by yourself. That's gonna suck. Go chill for a second, dude. I'm, I'm looting everything I could. Here. You'll need these. Take a look around the city. Old Villador. Plenty of interesting spots to check out. How do we use the binoculars, though? 
Okay, binoculars, press B to use them. Thank you. We can look around and as you look around, stuff gets marked on your map. Sounds great to me. You see the church? That's where the howlers were after us. It's the center of the district. Somewhere here is a marker. At least it sounds like it. <laughs> Be scoozy, sir. There's a church. Uh -huh. You can find notice boards with missing people around the city. One of them is near the church. Maybe somehow you'll find something about your sister there. And if not, just have fun. The world's already ended, right? How could things get any worse? I'll be back in touch when I've got a handle on things. Where is he going? Open up the map. Okay, you've unlocked the world map. Uh, you can zoom in and out. Cool. That's pretty nice. Uh, all the world activities are going to be discovered with your binoculars. Okay, and we can set waypoints. Is there a way for me to move the map? Maybe not yet. Let me get that out of, a, out of the way. So this is the safe zone. Where is the church, though? Rest? I mean, we are looking in that direction. So here we go. There's the church, I think. So I think this is the church. At least it looks like it, though. I'm gonna just set a waypoint over here. And we also want to grab the save point. I guess we'll grab the save point first. Okay, you've now unlocked uh, a villager as a goal. Okay. A mer it's a merchant. Wow. So there's a merchant actually in the church, because it looked like a bag icon. So bag icon is merchant, then a bed is the resting place, and then we have a stash also. Looks like a bag. Use your binoculars and survey the area to reveal additional locations on the map, like windmills, uh, which active new safe zones. Okay, activates new safe zones. That is pretty awesome. And as you explore what your compass encounters, uh, they offer a chance to help some villadors, citizens, in exchange for experience and various rewards. That is pretty nice. And then we have co-op mode. You've unlocked co-op mode with Dying Light 2. A great way to experience the game and explore co-op options. Enter the online menu by pressing G while in inventory. Online menu allows you to connect to other sessions. Uh, by choosing quick join and find games. I'm gonna play just the story though, so I'm not gonna play co-op mode. Bloody ties. Who doesn't want hundreds of fans chanting their name in perfect unison? Uh, or feel that uh, that they are loved and admired to obtaining unimaginable riches in the same t at the same time. But what if you want it all? One needs to pay the highest of prices. You've activated Bloody Ties. It's a new adventure city. Villador. Follow the first blood mission. So I'm pretty sure that is a DLC right there. Nobody. This group. They host violent prize fights here in the city. But that's just a cover. 
What they're really up to is way more sinister. Okay, so Dark Hollows and for Forsaken Stories. Or stores, sorry. Uh, are two locations vulnerable loot? Uh, during the day, they're full of infected. So it's smart to explore them at night. Okay, so provide rare crafts. Dark Hollows are the best place to find valuables and old world money. Loot them to increase your wealth. He saw me and he's like, okay, I'm leaving. Medium difficulty, apparently. I can't remember which game I played that had the same lockpick. Throwing spear. Are you fucking serious? You gotta be fucking with me. I got a bad feeling. What the fuck is, is that? What I think it is? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, this roof is taken. Okay. There's some zombies there. Can we climb up this pipe? Yeah, you can. Where's this interest point? 50 meters that way? Yeah, let's go for it, man. Come here, zombie. I wonder if we're gonna get to a skill ever that will... Oh, that's nice. Uh, that will... I don't know, we can repair our weapons or something. Oh, nice. I'm glad you see me. There's so many of them. Yo, wait, 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 I got a skill, my friend. Dodge. Just the right time to, to stagger your enemy. I actually like this. Uh, when dropping onto enemies, you can kick them. Now, I'm gonna take this. The dropping thing won't happen often enough for it to be really good. Okay, let's go. How you lost it now, motherfucker? <laughs> 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 Oh, 
Bro, where the heck is all these enemies coming from? <coughs> I'm up, dude. What the hell is my character doing? Uh, I. We need to craft healing, clearly. So we can get them mixed up. your items, bro. They did a really good job in fighting each other for me. And we were really close to dying, so... We got a side quest done or something. I'm not too sure. Whoa, where did you come from? We have a timer? We have a timer, dude. That zombie doesn't know if he wants to stand or sit. Didn't really plan to do this, but it works, so... I was hoping to get loot from you, dude. I get nothing for killing that poor guy chopping a tree? I got you. At least you gave me something. Some useful stuff. Unlike this guy. 
He had nothing. I killed him for no reason. I feel bad now. That's okay, man. going what a day no freaking way i can do it hey bro what's the problem hey aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang man you were in luck there i could use some of that luck i'm alberto's apprentice not for long probably it's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. Hey, what's a Craftmaster? You're not from around here, right? Craftmasters are people who invent new technology, design innovations, all sorts of gadgets that might help in combat. Alberto's the grand master around here. Like I said, I'm his apprentice. People laugh at him, that he's slow and not very eloquent, but he's a real friggin' genius. What's this test about? Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. Yeah, that's a little rough. Stressed goats can give bitter milk. Seriously? Goats get stressed? Wouldn't you, if someone electrocuted you and then went for your crotch? Oh, no. It's only a very small voltage. Won't do more than tickle them. So, what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see, as far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure. But it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. I have the parts you need. Do we? <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just fantastic. Heaven must have sent you. Now here. I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. Wait till he sees it. Meet me by the goat pen then, near the wall. Someone's been stealing our water. Track the invention. Anything about it. Aiden, how's it been, kid? Could it taste my city life yet? Uh, I've been here and there. You know, the best part is always happening in the center. And that's where we're going. I have a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Meet me on the roof near the main metro station. Fate like that. We'll just do this thing first. You hear the goats go off, dude.
I don't I don't like the fact that it's gonna electrocute goats, but if it's a if it's a thing that we have to do to survive, then yeah, we'll help. We somehow have to get to the roof now. I think. What about vegetables? There's not enough nitrogen. You have to improve your soil. Everything all right? No. It's grilled. The goat is grilled. I'm such an idiot. B what happened? I must have overcalculated the voltage. See, he's useless. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could get it so wrong. I told you it would be a waste of time. Why? I don't think so. This is very, very... It has big, huge... You're saying it has potential. Potential, yes. It could be an effective weapon. A weapon? It's a ready formula. If you just use it on a weapon, it could raise your odds against turned creatures. The brave goat gave its life to science. There's dinner for everyone. And you? I take you as a... Uh, and pronounce you a... Uh, uh, a, uh, craft master? Really? Oh my gosh, thank you, thank you. We'll talk later. Come, Vincenzo. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. If it's not strong enough, come around to my craft master workshop. Sure, thanks. Just, uh, watch yourself out there, okay? No worries, friend. That poor goat is toast, dude. Uh, to install a weapon mod, uh, you need to have a blueprint for it. Uh, any required craft parts. And the right weapon. Check the number of mod slots. Uh, okay. So, yeah. Uh, the best weapon will have three slots available. Grip, shaft, and tip. Different mods fit into different slots. Uh, press I for your new inventory and then choose the right weapon and C to modify it. No slots on any weapons we have. So it's marked it to go to the roof, uh, but there's a craft master here somewhere. In Carnage Hall, the surprise of the strong face off. They're still here. What does your brother say? To be I don't want to so here's the craft master. To hear that, you think there's Are something wrong with me? Trade. Merchants. Oh, it's a merchant, it's not a craft master. <clears throat> Allows you to buy craft. Item, uh, craft parts, new weapons, and other items. As well as sell valuables, unwanted loot that you collect. Uh, they offer the most powerful weapons. Uh, so visit them uh, often to increase your combat strength. Uh, you find merchants in all of the hubs. Okay. Inside the facilities and settlements. So he's... Selling this. Goodness. I think the biggest part is that the weapons does have mod equips that you can put on. Low stamina bonus. Full health damage bonus. Stamina regeneration on quick attack. How do you, how do you even do a larger attack though? Sell all value. Sell all valuables. I'm scared to do that. But I'm, I did it, so... <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, we'll buy this one. Combat experience, stamina melee weapons. Mushroom, absorb a huge amount of UV light. Stave off invasion. And then on this one, if I think, we, what do we press? C, modify, we can put this on. Plus 50 weapon durability, though. That is really nice. I want to not use that weapon at all. If I have the option. So this is the Craftsman, he upgrades blueprints, pretty much. To upgrade blueprint, you need to bring him the Craftsman in exchange for blueprint, okay. Uh, items, blueprint upgrades, uh, special infected, uh, which is easier to find at night. Take a look and choose. UV bar. So we could buy this. So this is buy, then we have an upgrade also. I don't know what you get if you upgrade them. Do you get bigger heals or just does it become cheaper to craft them? So we have uh, endurance booster, maximum stamina duration, uh, uncommon ammunition, effect radius duration. Duration is 60 seconds. I don't like this. This is just... This is just like food or something. Come here. Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julia, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Devin says. What? But I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast! Haven't seen my kids what the heck just happened, dude? Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. So, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. Oh, no. Bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flower is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. 
Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. So that's the pilgrim. Don't look like much of a sinner. I'm not a sinner, dude. What makes you think I'm a sinner? The first huh? tournament in three years. They'll I'm sorry, little kid. The toughest fighters in the city. They want to keep leading me out. Don't I have like a bed here? I don't think we do, right? No, we do not. Like my, my food is done. I actually would like to go eat, but it's okay. I gave you money to buy water, and what did you do? The card was good for me. How should I know this is There was a group. Okay, so a hundred meters away, we have something to do. Why does this five minutes thing, dude? Ah, okay. Okay, we're, we're turning in five minutes. Okay, so... Okay, that makes more sense now. We need to be... We need to be in sun. Hello, dude. There you go. So you see the timer restarts when we... Just get sun. Okay. Now this makes a little bit more sense. Bro, I don't think we're gonna make that jump. Okay. I was about to whoop his ass. But he's not enemy. Okay, so we need to get all the way up there. Okay, we made the jump. Hi, Con. Hey, you're a better climber than one crazy girl I used to know. <laughs> she was something. She even wanted to climb the tallest building in the city. The VNC Tower. Was she one of your wives? Almost. Too hot-tempered. Even for my tastes. And what about this passage to the center? Right. Look, from this roof you can clearly see the Peacekeeper's base. So the PK run the city? They sure think they do. That's what they need the uniforms and ranks for. They tattoo them. They're fucking obsessed with hierarchy. <laughs> but they don't control the city. At least not all of it. Who controls the rest? The Colonel. The Renegades. Oh, you won't meet them here. For now. Wait, you brought me here to take a look at the Peacekeepers? The PK are your ticket to the center. I told you the only way to get there is through the metro tunnels. I'll go inside and draw their attention away from the platform. Then you enter the Metro Technical Station. There's an airlock there. We'll take it together to the central loop. We can't just ask them to let me through? No chance. Right now, each new face they see belongs to a suspect in their commander's murder. They know me. I trade with them sometimes. I deliver lamps from the girls, or goods from dark zones. There might be a few infected there. Nothing a pilgrim can handle, though. When you get to the main station, let me know. Now you better get some sleep. You'll head out at night, when there's less infected in the tunnels. I guess it's sleeping time. <clears throat> huh? 
There's a creature uh, I haven't seen before. What does it look like? No, no, not a big one. Extremely fast. Probably a bolter. You can find some interesting stuff on them. But catching one requires serious hunting skills. Now is not the best time for this, Aiden. Head for the tunnels. We will head for the tunnels within the next episode. My goodness, dude. I'm gonna be honest, so far this game has been insanely awesome. I really enjoy it so far. And I really hope it it is something that you guys also enjoy. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day watching these videos. Appreciate the love and support. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you beautiful people in the very next video. Love you guys, take care. And as always, remember to twist some nips. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, have a great time. <laughs>